Well, they've spent the last 17 years underground, but the sounds of cicadas will soon fill the air on Long Island. And as News 12's Logan Crawford tells us, the insects have reemerged. You may say there's some of the sounds of summer. Cicadas are those small bugs that can cause a big racket. I haven't seen them yet this year. Uh, I have seen them in the past. And experts say the insects that come out of the ground only every few years could possibly reemerge again here on Long Island. Fewer and fewer cicadas come out every time. Chris Simon is a professor of ecology and biology at the University of Connecticut. She got her PhD from Stony Brook University and has been studying cicadas on Long Island for decades. She says there are many different groups of cicadas and one of the ones native to Long Island could come out this spring after not being seen for years. But she says the population has been declining. There's lots of different reasons and so it's hard to point your finger at just one because one of them would be uh, land clearing. She says this particular kind was last seen 17 years ago in Connecticut River State Park in Oakdale. But she says even then, there were much fewer of them. It's one part of the ecosystem, and when we start removing piece here, a piece there, um, the more pieces you remove, uh, the more uh, the ecosystems decline. Experts say they want to keep track of the cicadas here on Long Island. They say you can help by using this free app you can download called Cicada Safari. You can take a picture of a cicada if you see it or shoot a video of them if you hear them in the trees. And using the app, you can send them to the scientists who study them. A team of students will look at the photographs, verify that they're cicadas, and then report the data to us. Simon says be on the lookout for the noisy bugs starting in late May. Logan Crawford, News 12 Long Island.